My name's John Stevens. I'm a librarian working within the Access and Information Division specifically. Back when I decided to go down the librarian path, I had basically, I just just finished an arts degree. I wasn't sure exactly where I wanted to take, take those skills further and thought about it a little bit and then decided that librarianship would work for me, which I have since figured out number of my friends had me pegged as a librarian many years before then, uh, something about the way I catalogue my music collection. It's, it's not subject categorised, I have issues with that, uh, which can involve long boring conversations about the subjectivity of subgenres, but primarily it's uh, alphabetical. Um, I have had interesting arguments about whether to alphabetise according to surname or first name. Uh, I, I try and keep quiet about it though because it did, does tend to make me a bit, you know, Antisocial, so that's uh, with a collection that's edging towards four figures. Um, it's kind of necessary. Otherwise, I I just don't find anything, and I forget what I have, which would be terrible as a librarian. My favourite items from the collection in, invariably come from our rare printed scene collection. Uh, for example, th this particular one here is one of the first uh, zines that I remember making a very very strong impact on my life. Uh, when I first got involved in zines it was uh, around about eight years ago and I was volunteering at a local store called Sticky which uh, sells zines and this particular one is the highest selling zine in the store till to today. It's um, going to a number of different reprints, which for a zine is amazing. It's interesting also from a librarian's point of view because it's near impossible to catalogue. It's uh, the There's no listing of uh, who actually wrote it. There's an email address, but it doesn't really indicate much. It's a pseudonym uh, that the writer has used. We, we can guess from reading it that the author is male, but we don't know that for certain. It says second edition, and also please email. There's nothing else written in there other than the title. The most satisfying thing are, are reference inquiries that are quite difficult, not necessarily very uh, straightforward. So often ones I don't know exactly where to go to begin with, but ones where ultimately I um, end up finding the information that the patron needs, not necessarily uh, how they would have uh, um, worded it to begin with. Uh, often the difficulty is um, getting the, the real question from from the patron. And personally though, my, my favourite patrons are new PhD students. When they come in there, um, they're really eager to know everything, and, and but everything and also in a very focused way. So they want to know all the resources that are applicable to them. Uh, they don't necessarily want to know how to, how to operate each and every different resource, if you're talking electronic, or how to find print or microform resources straight away. But they want to know what's there, and they want to know how much they can use the library and how much we can help them.